the, the, the history of why that's called an inky is quite interesting. It's um, because this, most of these funny names for lamps originally came from Hollywood. And in the early days of Hollywood, everything was lit with arc lamps, uh, which were enormous, difficult things to handle, but created enormous amounts of light, which they needed in the early days with low, slow film stocks. But somebody came up with this little gizmo for when you want to get a bit of a little tiny bits of light in, instead of these enormous arc lights. And this was the only incandescent light on the set. So it became known as an inky. inky yeah. You didn't know that, did you, Alan? <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> so that's why this became known as the inky, because it was the only incandescent light on yeah. the set when everything else was, was arcs. Mm. Um, and of course, the name stuck. And this is the type of lamp. I, I mean, they're basically a focusing spotlight with a Fresnel mm. lens. Was what we always used before any of this. And, and when I first started at the BBC, this is what we were using. And there were just a whole range of these. This is the smallest. At what, 300 watts this, was it? 150. 150. Mm. Then we got a thing called a Mizar came along. That was about 250 yeah, or something. Yeah, they got bigger. Yeah. Then the Pup was 1,000 watts. Or oh, 500. Or oh, 500, sorry. Mm. You know but this better than I do. Mm. You had to add it up. <laughs> um, and then, the, then there'd be a 2K, 5K, mm -hmm. and 10K. And the 10K was enormous. But then but all this type of lamp. But with your terminology of Hollywood, of course, they, it, it, a lot of that has stuck with the lighting in this country. The, the English have a, a different terminology to film lighting than the Americans. But some of it crossed over. And uh, where Americans have uh, seniors and juniors, we wouldn't do that. We would have a 2K and a 1K, which represents their strength. And in, in England, we would have a stand. In America, they call it a stalk. Mm. Them, stands, yeah. And um, so in America, this would be a stalk. And in England, a stand. And then the soft light that David's talked about, they also had, which they called a basher. <laughs> and that was the, again, uh, a, in the incandescent days. Uh, yes, but open fronted, no, open no lens fronted, on the With front a big photo um, uh, bulb in it, yes. a big, uh, huge thing. Yeah. 500 watts or something. Yes. So they, the, the American uh, terminology is still today being used in, in the English film industry. And consequently, yeah. some lamps are universal, like these. You will probably find that even abroad, these are still called blondes, redheads, and there was a brunette as well, funny enough. Was there? Yes. I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> but I, mean, I think they somehow disappeared.